Ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to Minecraft 1.21. In the last episode, we made our cozy cottage, as this is going to be called. And after I had built this, I completely forgot to say where this house actually was inspired from. But before I do that, it looks like I have a little bit of food shortage, which is uh, not ideal for what I'm going to be doing today. Hey, doggy. Uh, yeah, we still don't have any name tags. I need to see, do I have, I do have some string. Uh, I may try and do a little bit, tiny bit of fishing if that is possible. I also seem to have absolutely no wood, so that's also a bad, that, that, that's bad. Need to collect some stuff. Um, we're gonna go in this direction. But yeah, that house is originally inspired from the very first house that I built when I started playing Minecraft in 1.7.10. When I started playing Minecraft uh, X amount of years ago, whenever 1.7.10 was a thing, uh, basically I was watching tutorial videos to understand how on earth to play the game. And I was watching Paul Source Jr.'s uh, Survive and Thrive series, and he built not that exact house, but he built a house like it and called it a, a uh, cozy cottage. And that is why I chose that specific house, because it reminded me of that. I thought it was very fitting, and that is where that house design originally uh, was inspired from. And I just thought that would be interesting to know. And I'm actually very happy with this. Are you, do you have, what did you have? Nothing, okay, good. Uh, yeah, very happy with how this turned out. I do want to decorate stuff and I have plans for that. But today I think that it is a good idea to close that and to go ahead and go mining a bit because we need resources. Uh, we could do with some more iron because, uh, oh yeah, my goodie chest is upstairs. It's been a while. I do apologize. Uh, but yeah, this is all the stuff that we have. I think I might use three iron ingots for an extra iron pickaxe because this one has seen better days. And then I think we're good to go. I also have absolutely no torches because I have no coal. This is all the coal that I have. So I should see if I can potentially get some coal before we head down in a cave somewhere. And I think I have an idea of where I want to go caving. Uh, but first, food issue is uh, not ideal. So I'm going to go ahead and do this, do this. And I think, uh, yeah, let's go ahead and make that extra pickaxe right off the bat. That's our extra food. I mean, we do have enough food, but or not enough, but we do have some food. But since we do have some time before the sun sets anyway, I might as well do a little bit of fishing and uh, see how we do with that. I mean, there, there's some manual fishing over there that I could do. I'll probably do that right as the sun sets, but until then, might as well just uh, sit around here and fish. And it's not very rare, it's not very often that you fish in Minecraft, I feel, because it is slow and not very efficient, etc. But it's fun. I find it fun and also kind of relaxing, so we're gonna do it. And I guess while I'm fishing, I did see one comment on my first episode saying, dude, you ran through a desert, it ran through like two or three villages and you didn't pick up a single bed. What are you doing? And that is something that I wanted to talk about, not to comment specifically, but just in general how I'm going to be playing this series. Oh, we have a bite. Hold on. Yeah, there we go. But yeah, I'm not going to play this series fast paced whatsoever. I'm just going to take it slow. And there are some things that you may see other people or I don't know how to how to say it. The traditional quote unquote way Minecraft has. Uh, we have turtles. My, Minecraft has become to play where you raid villages and you set up villages, trading posts and stuff like that. There are some things that I'm not going to do in the series. Specifically, for example, villager trading posts. I'm not going to do that because that is one of the reasons I think why I stopped playing vanilla Minecraft when the villager change was implemented and they got so overpowered, in my opinion. That's when I started stopped playing. And so I'm not going to set up stuff like that. I will trade with villagers. But it's going to happen from village to village. So if I want a villager with mending, for example, maybe I have to go through seven villages, thousands of blocks away to get it. And if that's what it takes, that's the journey I have to take in order to get a mending book. And I really like the idea of that. So that's what I'm going to go for. And also not raiding villages completely. And in that first episode, I just wanted a challenge to be able to not have a bed right off the get go because that also feels like to me cheating to a water bottle. Okay, well, I mean, we got five fish. 
and we do have salmon here and they will i believe spawn back so we're not gonna run out so i'm just gonna quickly do some manual fishing uh <laughs> get that one get that one okay i think we're good now I think we should be settled now because we have six of these, we have three cod, and then we have 40 bread and already five cooked salmon in here. So when the sun rises, after I've done cooking these, that was honestly fun fishing. We need a fishing hut so I can do that more, more often. Fishing sessions. Uh, oh yeah, that's my mind. I was like, what's that? <laughs> what's that light? I keep forgetting stuff. Uh, right, let's put this to cook. We'll have to use wood for now. And just plug this water bottle in here. Why did I leave uncooked ores in here? I'm not sure why I did that, but I did it apparently. So that's a thing. And while that is melting, we have oh, we have spiders. So we have it. And didn't we have an? In I'm pretty sure we had an endman over there. Do we have any coal around here that is easily accessible? I said easily accessible, not uh, annoyingly accessible. I mean, there is that potential monster cave. I do want to see if they are still around or not. <laughs> that, that monster cave was so bizarre. And if you don't know what I'm talking about, if you're new, welcome to the channel. Uh, if you're new, you'll see what it is in just a moment. All right, there we go. Food is cooked. We have We have a good amount of food now. I think we have a good amount of food now. Let's go to bed. Let's check that monster cave. See if it's still completely running with mobs. And uh, if it is, run away and just hope that we find some coal elsewhere. I almost went away with my fishing rod. That's not ideal. I'll leave that in here. And ah, no, 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 no. Go away. Thank you. All right. Uh, yeah, it's this direction. Where did you come from? Must have seeked shelter under the trees. Interesting. And I just realized I didn't make a shield. I had one iron ingot remaining and I didn't make a shield. That, that, hmm. That's going to be interesting, but oh well. Well, I haven't seen it from this angle before. This place, is, this place truly is incredible. I see some iron up there. I see some coal up there. And I see three zombies. This could be fine. But all the other times, it, it hasn't been fine. <laughs> really, really hasn't been fine. Gotta climb this first, though. Uh, it seems potentially okay. Nope, nope, it's not. It's not okay. It's not okay. Okay. <laughs> I don't know why there's so many mobs there. I guess it's because it's above water and there might not be many spawn areas. So it automatically works as a mob farm. I don't know, but uh, that, that's apparently it. Also, uh, if you want to play as in the same seed as me, by the way, the seed is down below in the description, or you can see it here, right there for you. Uh, I forgot to announce it the other two episodes, but there you go. All right, onwards we go. I need to find that cave area that I have in mind. It should be in this direction. I really hope I can find it because it looked ginormous and it looked interesting. Uh, and we'll see what we get. Uh, hopefully a lot of iron. Hopefully we'll get some diamonds, redstone, some lapis as well. If we can get diamonds to get a diamond pickaxe, that would be great. Stuff like that. We'll see what happens. Um, ooh, coal. Actually, this is not where I wanted to go, but this is a great pit stop because we do need coal. And there is some iron down there. Could give us a little bit more cobblestone. All right. Oh, there's even more. This is good. So now we're not going to run out of torches anytime soon. Hello. Uh, this is not where I intended to go. And I don't think I'm going to stay here for long, but we do need coal. We do need coal, so I am going to get that. By the way, this episode might be over an hour long, honestly, because when I cave, for some reason, I like to ramble a lot. <laughs> Uh, so this is just gonna be a chill episode. Maybe it's gonna be an hour long, 50 minutes. I don't know, but uh, I like to ramble a lot when I cave and then time adds up and then uh, all of a sudden an hour and 30 minutes, but uh, we'll see what happens. See, coal is very tedious to mine, but it's also a resource that you really do need, especially in the early game when you haven't set up any kelp farms or anything like that. Setting up a manual kelp farm would be kind of cool though. I'm going to take these torches now because I do I do want them and I'm not going to stay here for long. I just really want to get the iron if I can down there. 
dying over there. I do apologize for the darkness as well. You know what? I'm going to hold the torch in my left hand. That's a dead end as well. Okay, that makes this easy then. That's a death trap waiting to happen. So we're not going to risk it with that. There we go. Get this iron. A little bit of iron. And that's actually five pieces. That's not bad. And some more coal to wrap up this cave. All right. This cave is now done for. There's that coal up there. But I really can't be bothered taking it when it's like difficult to reach. Coal is not that hard to get our heads on. I'm definitely not going to bother with the cop copper at the moment. I will be bothering with the sign down here, though, because that I do actually really want. Ow. That was... Okay. <laughs> Ow. Was that worth it? Uh, maybe. Maybe. Potentially. I'm going to leave cobblestone here so I can actually bridge and do stuff like that. Okay. Now, question. I all of a sudden... Oh. Oh, hey, fellas. Oh, I need to make a brush. I need to make a brush so we can make wool armor. Wool armor, wolf armor. I need to do that. I really do need to do that. Okay. Uh, we'll do that after our mining trip. How about that? But maybe. Or maybe we'll do it next episode because I also need feathers. We may do it next episode. Uh, <laughs> that's also not the cave we're looking for. I know it's in this area. I just don't know exactly where. There's a little bit of coal here, so I'll grab that as it's easy to get. And we now have over a stack of coal. That is not bad. I could go down there, but I, there's a bigger cave that I really, really want to find. Actually, I hate leaving blocks like that in the, in the world. I know I'm being picky, but I really, really hate doing that. This is not good news, ladies and gentlemen. I don't think I can actually find it anywhere. I even looked at my screenshots if I had noted it down, but I had... Wait. Wait. Uh, this could potentially be it. I don't think this is it. I remember a very, very deep hole that I definitely took note of. But I just looked at my screenshots and I didn't actually note it down with a screenshot. So I guess this is uh, this is going to have to do <laughs> for now anyway, uh, until I can find the other place. I mean, this looks like it could go down deep. So let's let's jump in and see what happens here. Only downside would be if it turns nighttime and this is a dead end, then we're stuck. Ooh, okay. Yeah, yeah okay, yeah, this might be it. <laughs> this is, um, this goes down deep. So let's go ahead and grab a water bucket before we go anywhere. That's always a smart idea before going on a trip like this. Let's go ahead and do that so we can get back up. Let's, uh, let's place it here, I guess. I want to be able to get up easily. So I'm going to leave it there, I think. I mean, I see some iron. That's potential here. I see redstone. Ooh, yeah, this might be it, actually. I think this... Oh, yeah, I think this is it. Either way, this works. <laughs> this is great. Uh, I do want to cap off the water here, though, so we don't get a complete flood, so I can actually see what on earth is happening. There we go. So we can easily get up and down, like I want to get up now, because I see this iron here. Yeah, There we go. Get this. This is what I wanted to find right here. Getting down to deep slate level. What I didn't want to find is a witch. That's something I didn't want to find. And I don't have a shield. That's a whole... Is it just me or do I keep finding places with a lot of mobs? I don't know if I like it. I like all the iron though. But I don't know if I like all those mobs. Maybe I should make a shield before continuing. This could be deadly. There's also an ender... Oh, okay. There was a... There, see, there's also an enderman. That zombie's now coming towards me. Sun is going down, so we're stuck down here. We're stuck down here because I think this is going to be safer than upstairs. That's for sure. In at least a little a little bit. We do have iron armor, though. We do have iron armor, so that's good. Uh, remember to place torches behind us so we can actually find our way out. Okay. Okay, here we go. Here we go. Can I get the... Okay. I wanted the skeleton to hit the zombie. But this skeleton seems to be shooting like a stormtrooper, so I'm not too worried. <laughs> and if you don't watch Star Wars, then you won't get that reference, but uh, that's just too bad. Uh-oh. Please. Please. Why is that two? I just... That's... I can't block. Honestly, a shield... Ow. Would be a great idea. Yeah, maybe I should make a shield. I mean, I have plenty of iron now. It's not like I'm lacking in it. Because, yeah, 21. 
Hmm. I may make a shield. We may need other iron tools as well, a new iron sword and stuff. Yeah, we'll wait. We'll wait and see what happens. We'll wait and see what happens. I heard another zombie though. Let's take care. Of Ooh, Enderman. I'm. Mm. I could take on an Enderman. I mean, getting an Ender Pearl would be kind of cool. But. Hey, fella. Hi. Yeah, hi. I don't know if it's worth the risk, though. If it teleports and then ambushes me or something, I could be in great, great trouble. So I don't know if it's worth it. That's so much iron here. Wow. Like, seriously. And this cave continues. On to glow squid. Uh, I want to stay in the big cave, but now that I see this, I do want to quickly just grab it. That's my torch is done. <laughs> Ooh, nine coal and nine sticks. That is perfect. Perfect amount. I want to get this. Uh, okay, yeah, that's, that's, that's a lot to do here. Ooh, that might be the first time I've actually grabbed glowing sack. That's cool. That would make sense, because I haven't really been on the ground yet now, have I? Uh, don't want to go... I do want to go, because there's iron here. We're getting so much iron. <laughs> I love these mining trips, they're so fun. Okay, I don't think I'm gonna go further than this, because I really don't want to pick up diorite and stuff like that. Don't have a use for it at the moment. Probably gonna hate myself for it, but if I am gonna make a build of something where I need it, I'm gonna need more than what I get from mining way, my way to iron. I'm not gonna keep going in that direction. I want to stay near the big cave. I will grab this lapis, though. Just because. Nice. We will want to do enchanting at some point. Hey, fella. Ow. Don't do that. And I just remembered that we are able to potentially find deep dark. <laughs> that... That's new. Uh, not new, new, obviously. But you know what I mean. It's uh, new for me to be able to find deep dark when caving. I really hope I see it before it's too late. But we'll, we'll find out. I mean, you have a couple of uh, attempts slash tries before... Where did you guys come from? I was just up there. Before the one spawned, so that's good. We will grab the gold. Uh, could make golden carrots. If we actually get carrots. Golden apples. Good stuff like that. Oh. Hello. I do love tough. And... In, oh, I need tough. Yes, I definitely need tough. I love the tough block. But now... It's even better. I mean, it's honestly even better. Oh, hello. I like this. Plenty of iron. It's good. Question is if we're going to get in that. I can I can see how we can't get diamonds today. At least from that big hole over there. And what's this? That just goes down. Scary. Scary stuff. Don't know if I like it. I'm going to make a bridge. There we go. Semi-safe. Definitely gonna grab this redstone. Don't know what I'm gonna make with it just yet, but we will want to make something with it soon. Maybe not soon, but at some point. Soon is not the word that I was looking for there. There are honestly so much to this. It's unbelievable. I keep getting sidetracked with these, like, branches because that's resources and I want the iron. <laughs> but I keep getting sidetracked because, like, I want to stay near the big interesting thing, but then I'm like, oh, but there's all that iron over there. I need to get that. I can't leave that there. I'm picking up the die right even though I said I wouldn't. Couldn't really get around it there. Uh, and hopefully, I just don't get lost from being able to find that again. Like, I'm not going to continue on these, but if I find iron like this, I mean, I, I have to get it. <laughs> I just have to. Ooh, maybe we'll find a geode, I just realized. I do want to find a geode. That would be kind of cool. Oh, hey, fella. That's going to be interesting. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. There we go. Getting a bow, honestly, would be good. But I don't really have any arrows other than these two. So we may need to take care of that. How did you... Okay. Guess there was dark enough for it to spawn. That's fine. Okay, we'll get back to this. We'll get back to that. I just want to keep exploring this section first. Ooh, there's even more tough here. That's brilliant. And redstone. Good. Because you can now make tough bricks. 
I believe, and a bunch of other tough stuff. Like if I get this, I don't know if I need to smelt for something first. Or if I, I can make polish tough and then I can make tough bricks. I mean, that's just... I love that block. I really, really do. Okay, I do want to go down that way as well. I just want to... Oh boy. <laughs> uh, this, I, I like this. This is... Oh. Okay, I'm going to mark places where I could potentially go and get lost. Where I need to go in order to get out. Because... Yeah. Yeah. I don't think I'm gonna grab any tough right now. I'll probably get it just before we leave this cave area. I think is the plan. Ooh, more glow squid. They are honestly so cool. I think. A lot of people are probably gonna hate me for saying that, but deal with it. My opinion. <laughs> Ooh. That's our first diamond. Well, it's not our first diamond diamond, but it's our first found diamond. That's, that's, that's a lot. That is a lot, and I just... That's a one-block bridge. I don't like that. <laughs> that's creepy. Uh, that's a, sp a spawner. A spawner in the open like that. Okay, we're going down. We're going in. We're going in, ladies and gentlemen. I've also been told that... Oh, no. That one torch is enough to disable a spawner. So, that's going to be put to the test. That's a zombie spawner. Okay. I am now turning my back to the spawner. And this better be correct. <laughs> I'm just I, I'm just gonna make a stack of torches because we're gonna make it. Oh yeah, that's correct. Cool. Thank you for that. Uh, string. And we'll take the wheat and the gunpowder. Music disc. We'll take that. Some iron. We'll take that. Horse armor is good. Saddle is good. Uh, I'll take all of this honestly. I don't need the chests though. Don't need those. We'll get the glowing sack. And I will block you so I can get this redstone. I was hoping for like a skeleton spawner or something, but I really shouldn't be picky like that. Okay, we're getting to our first ever diamonds. Let's go. Uh, not gonna bo I'm not gonna bother with like redstone in the ceiling and stuff like that. I really can't be bothered with that because it does such a big abundance. Uh, I'm gonna take a screenshot of this and that may or may not be the thumbnail. Here we go. First ever diamond. Let's go. That was just one, though. Uh, there was one there. I saw three. There we go. There it is. There it is, right next to the lava where it's extra dangerous. Let's see. One, oh, two. Three. Four. Oh, yeah. That's lovely. Five diamonds. We can make a diamond pickaxe now and an enchantment table. We could get obsidian from here. We could get obsidian from this place, I just realized. Uh, do I do that? It is... I think... Oh, wow. One, two, three, four, five, six. Oh, wow. Eleven diamonds. <laughs> that's a good haul. Not gonna lie. That's pretty, pretty decent, I'd say. Uh, do I get obsidian now, though? It could be the only lava pit that I see today. But I also really love how this pit is just there. Like, I love this angle. Um, hmm. I don't know if I want to ruin that, honestly. Then it would probably be better finding one on the servers, which should be easy enough since we, are, we have desert on the other side of the... of the... of the pond. Uh... I think I'm gonna... I'm, I'm, it's stupid, but I'm gonna leave that there. I like it. I like it. Okay, well, that was our first diamond, and I think that that is this branch basically uh, taken care of. No, give me that back. Give me that back. We're gonna go this way. This is a dangerous encounter. Get off. Bye. Bye. Uh, yeah, we're gonna go up here, and then we're gonna check out that big branch that we found over there. Just gotta get through Mr. Creeper up here. Hello. That's the high ground. <laughs> high ground bad. Haha. <laughs> high ground is not good. Because I just won. <laughs> Alright, here it is. Guarded by a zombie, of course. Let's get rid of you. <laughs> okay. Um, cool. Good. This is a hole. That's diamonds. Cool. 
as lava. This is basically a death trap. <laughs> How am I gonna get down? Oh boy. Uh, okay. Hmm. Okay, hold down shift. That's a lot of mobs. Is this even going anywhere? Oh yeah, there's, there's a ledge there. This is basically... Okay. Um... Right. Easiest thing is honestly probably to plop this down and then go down like that. I think that's probably the best course of action. Wait for it to take care of that lava, turn it into cobblestone. It is gonna get rid of a lot of the light. Ooh, my sword is about to break as well. Do I take a quick pit stop and... you know what? I can get more tough. <laughs> Am I gonna take a quick pit stop, get some more iron cooking? I think I am, honestly. Uh, I am gonna make something, though. I'm gonna make something. And you can probably make out what it's gonna be. I'm pretty sure that this is not the crafting recipe. Uh, hold on, hold on. I'm almost certain that this is the recipe for a blasting furnace, but it is clearly not. Uh, is it... And then it's gonna be three iron and then five stone. Okay, that, that's what I wanted to make. I want to make a blast furnace, so this actually goes a little bit faster. <laughs> I remember now, it is not stone, it is cooked stone. So like this, and I need three of it. I'm pretty sure, three and then five iron ingots. I think five iron ingots is correct. I just need to cook stone into smooth stone. That's what I needed to do. Aha, there we go, smooth stone at the bottom, five iron ingots. And boom, we have a blast furnace, which means I can now cook these eight iron ingots way, way faster than before. And I think one thing I'm gonna make is gonna be a shield, not necessarily to use it, but I just so I have it in case I get in a situation. And I could make an iron pickaxe, but I could also make a diamond one. I think I will though. I will go ahead and make an iron one for now, uh, just because. I will need an iron sword though, as well. And there we go, go ahead and make another iron pickaxe. Inventory is getting a little bit cluttered. I know I won't be needing that stone. I could throw away the arrows even though I could make a bow. Uh, yeah. I think this is good. I can throw away the stick. I just want to be prepared, you know. Just want to be prepared. Alright. There's an enderman down there. Alright, here we go. Yeah. What's that? Go like it. Ah! Okay, that was a way faster descent than I well, had planned. Uh, oh boy. Okay. Start by outlining the area and making it secure. I think is the best course of action. I'm getting rid of the enemies. Ow! One by one. Come on. There we go. Not today, thank you. Nice. Okay. I'm not gonna hold that. Ooh, diamonds right there. And up there. That's sick. I love finding these. That's one. Oh, two. Three. Not bad. We're getting a lot of diamonds from this. We could potentially get diamond armor very soon. Oh, that's you, Dan. Oh. I was gonna put you out of your misery, but I was slow, apparently. <laughs> Can I drop anything? I really don't want to drop anything, honestly. This is... You know what, the copper. I don't care about the copper, I would rather have the lapis. Honestly. And the one. And just one. Nope. Always mine an extra block to see two. See, if I'd just gone for after that, I would have not gotten two extras. And I saw something back here. Okay, it's just a small hole. Not worth to get whatever's in there. Not worth it at all. Okay, yeah, so keep putting a border of torches. Uh... Uh, ow. Okay. Let's get a bit of you fellas now. Okay. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. That is fine. This is ow. This is fine. Need to keep an eye on the skeleton. Yep. Come on. Yep. Get that. Sorry, bat. Oh, that actually killed the zombie. <laughs> nice. Get rid of you. There's another skeleton up there. Quickly eat and heal. This place is sick. Honestly. Okay, there's a zombie here. Don't know, did I attack that skeleton? Not yet. Get rid of you. Place more torches. 
This is okay. I that I'm close to a ledge here. This is not a good corner to be an owl. Hold shield. Ah, I hate how sometimes the skeleton just manages right as you you lift the oh diamond, you lift the shield and yet the skeleton still gets the arrow through. It's so weird and annoying, and that's deadly. Uh, but it looks cool. We'll check it out. <laughs> After we've taken all the stuff that's here. Right, get this redstone. Hello, Mr. Creeper. Please don't blow up. Hold on. Oh, th I thought that was another opening that I had completely missed. It was not. Just a lava going down. More gold. I'll grab it. That's so... Ah, you're close. Ah. Go away. There's honestly so much stuff in all the edges. I'm not gonna go for all that, I don't think. One... Inventory space is cramped, and two- oh no. I heard a baby zombie, and I hate them. Where's the baby zombie? I don't see him? I guess- uh, oh, there's a cave entrance there. Okay. Yeah, there's so much on the edges. I don't know if I'm gonna go and get it all. I could probably fit it in my inventory, but... It's also a lot of effort. <laughs> <laughs> Don't know if I'm gonna get through, go for it. I mean, we can always come back as well. Like, look at all this stuff. A lot of it is copper, though. As well. Alright, let's get this diamond. Just one, I assume. Yep, just one. We have 18 diamonds now, though. Which is pretty good. Yeah, I think he's down below. So I can worry not as much. Good. And, man, I'm not gonna challenge you this day. Yet, anyway. Two spiders. That's gonna be interesting. Don't need the shield for you, though. May need the shield. Four. Go away. Oh, it's blocked off. Huh? In that case, I'm not gonna open up to, to deal with them. Because that will just be annoying. And I think with that, I have secured this bottom floor. And taken what is mostly of value. I'm not going to take more lapis because we already have a ton. I may go ahead and take some of this stuff up here. I mean, I know it's a waste to not get all the stuff out of the ledges, but... It'll be easier when we have enchantments and whatnot. Because right now we already have, like, a lot of stuff. We could always come back for it. We know where it is now, at least. I do want to check out this, though. This could lead to cool stuff. And also lots of dangers. I'm gonna mark our way out. Ooh. Yeah, this is uh, questionable. <laughs> this is very questionable. I'm gonna get this water here. Ooh, this could lead to another opening. Oh, there's a diamond there? Okay, I'll have to get that when I get when I go back. I'm just gonna block that. This is Interesting. Gonna go this way if I can. Can I? Maybe? I can. Uh. Eh. Nice. Okay. I'll leave you there. Do I have space for more redstone? I do have space for more redstone. Redstone is good. You can always use the redstone. And redstone is so annoying when, like, you need it and you don't have it. So, grabbing that. I will prioritize. Another dungeon. And a spider dungeon this time. Ugh. Spider dungeon. Oh, it's a dead end. Okay. That works for me. Ow. And a zombie coming up. Please go away. Put you there. Nice. Oh, two, three. This is my spawner. I found it first. Uh, at least that's my claim. And go away. Please. Go. Thank you. Okay. Nice. Huh. Imagine if there was a zombie spawner or something next to it. That would be cool. <laughs> oh, and there goes my pickaxe. Right. And let's see what we get. Run flash, some bread. Name tag. Our first name tag. Ladies and gentlemen, I'll, I'll drop the wheat. I'll drop the wheat. Iron horse armor. Yeah, you know what? I'll trade the spider eyes for that. That's a good trade, I'd say. I'd say. Um, do we have space for more redstone? We do, actually. So I'll grab this. But I do also want space for some tough. I know it's tough, but it's what I want. <laughs> yeah, ooh, diamond. And one, ooh, two, maybe three, three. 
Nice, 21 diamonds, and we already have what? F not five, three, two, two at home. So we have 23 in total now. Not bad, you know. I just have to navigate this lava infested place. So there's a diamond up there, there's a creeper there, and there's a diamond up there, which I really want to get as well. Even if it's just one, it'll hopefully uh, be worth it and not result in my doom. I'm worried about that creeper though. Oh, it's a, it's a, that's a section above this? Huh? I should have honestly brought dirt that I could bridge with instead of cobblestone. Here we go. Grab this. And then there's that up there. I don't have that many blocks to bridge with. That it's easy to get. I could... Oh, what do we have here? I'll just bridge like this, though. I think that'll work. Got more open area over there. I'm running out of cobblestone. <laughs> I'm actually running out of cobblestone. All right, here we go. And back it up, back it up. That's one. Only one? Ay, ay, ay. That, that, that could have been more. I'll put it that way. Really don't want to use cobble deep slate to bridge with, but since I don't really have a choice in the matter, uh, I'm not going to drop from there. That, nope. We'll drop from here, though. Anything useful? Anything? More diamonds, maybe? Could be. A little bit of iron. Uh, that could be... That could be something. Oh. It is something. Oh. Hello. Uh. There's a diamond up there. Get that on the way out. Wow. Okay, it's not as big when you start, like, exploring it, but it's there. You know? It does continue in that direction. And there's a diamond here. Uh, and there's a witch in that direction, which I really don't want to mess with. But, I think what I'm gonna do... I saw you. I think what I'm gonna do is get this diamond. That's another spawner! There's another... Go away. That's another spawner. <laughs> Okay, here's what I'm gonna do, because uh, this episode is probably getting lengthy. I'm gonna get this diamond, now actually, so I don't forget. Ooh, one, two, three, four, five, six. That was worth going over here for. Uh, we now have 29. Oh, there's a creep there. I'm gonna check out that dungeon now, and then I think I'm gonna slowly start to head back. It is morning, so if I head back now, I can probably make it home before it's too dark. So I think that is the plan. Another zombie spawner. It couldn't be skeleton. Skeleton would be cool. Skeleton would be really cool. But it's not. Oh well. Get rid of you. Eh, get the torch in there. Ow. Get, get, be gone, please. Thank you. <sighs> okay, what do we got? Golden apple. I'll take it. Coal. Uh, melon seeds we already have. An extra bucket is cool. Not gonna take the wheat. Uh, bone, string, run flesh, bread. Another saddle. Uh, no. No. I think I already have plenty of saddles, honestly. Yeah, we can come back to this. And that's another time. <laughs> Two, actually. Three. We can come back to this. Uh, maybe when we have enchantments or something like that. I don't know. Things will be easier for us. Uh, so, yeah, we will come back. We'll come back. They definitely have to. I'll leave a beacon or something so we know how to come back here. Um, yeah, I need to figure out how on earth to get back to the surface. There's more diamonds in there. I can't... I'm not gonna leave diamonds behind just like that. There's one up there and there's two in there. I'm gonna get those, then I'm gonna head out of here. One, two... Three, four. Not bad. I will just have a peek. No, wait. Uh, uh, two. What? Hold on. Hold on. Diamonds and diamonds. And that. <clears throat> I will get these diamonds and then I will head out of here. This journey is never ending. Honestly. It's sick though. <laughs> it's so awesome. 
But really, this journey is never ending. I really hope there's not a creeper because I have not secured this area one bit. I, I need to stop looking. I need to stop looking if I want to get out of here in one piece. <laughs> Look at this snow. Six. Six times. Eight. Se seven. Yep. Seven diamonds. We, we almost have a stack of diamonds from this. This is... Crazy. To say the least. Actually crazy. Mm -hmm. Didn't think the lava physics would do that. Didn't think they would do that. Didn't think they would do that. Didn't plan on them doing that. I could have gone bad. Yep. Yeah. Shouldn't greed. Which is what I'm doing right now. <laughs> I'm being greedy. I'm being greedy and it's not good when you go mining. Because you go too far and then something wrong happens and you regret it for the rest of your life. Literally. Also, I don't. it would take me more than five minutes to get down here. I don't know if I would be able to find it. Honestly, it's been pretty pretty easy to, to navigate this. Because it's all moving forward. It's not like all sorts of turns. And I think I've marked it fairly easily. Yep, 56 diamonds. Just get a game. Just, just need one peek. Just need one. Nope. Okay. Cool. 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 The game is stopping me. That's good. Okay. Here we are. Time. Oh, it's not just one. One, two, three, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Ladies and gentlemen. We have our first stack of diamonds. In fact, we have 66 diamonds because we have the ones at home as well. What is this? <laughs> this is honestly crazy. Okay, yeah, we need to head home now. If I die now, I I might cry, literally. And we can't have that, so... Uh, where's the exit? Oh dear, nope. Yeah, yeah that's, this is where I came from, that's right. This death trap of a bridge. Ooh, but I didn't get tough. I should get tough. Or maybe I shouldn't. Because I don't really have space. You know what? I'll come back for tough. We know where to get it now. It's definitely not a rare resource around here. So I'll come back for it when we need it. I'll leave that crafting table there. I'll bring the glass furnace. Okay, honestly... Honestly, we're surprisingly close to the surface. Like, we're out now. <laughs> I thought I would go, have to go through a lot more to get out, but nope. This was fairly easy. Honestly. Uh, I'll grab you. One piece of coal. I'll take it. And we're out. And the sun is about to set, so we need to actually hurry on a bit here. If we die, like, to a skeleton or something out here, that would be so embarrassing. So, not gonna doing that are we uh right this way i need to mark this i need to mark this with a pillar of some sort i will build up using deep slate indicating that it goes to deep slate maybe go up eight blocks and then you know what i have four torches remaining perfect boom and i'm gonna yeah i did it thought i didn't do it but i did it all right let us head home this has been a great adventure Oh. <laughs> um, I found the hole I was originally looking for. Uh, that's there. And I don't see any torches, so that means it's different from what we've... What we just went through. Um, carrying part two? Anyone? Nah, we'll, we'll get better stuff first. Probably enchantments before we go down again. I do need to find a lava pit, though. But that, I would say, was a pretty decent, and that's the mountain in the background, pretty awesome and decent mining mission. I'm very pleased with the result, and we didn't even have fortune on anything. There's our house in the background. We do need to make a bridge at some point. Probably a bridge like right here, leading onto the mainland. Just a small one, tiny one. And then we need to get a horse and camels. I really, really want camels. I don't know how, but I really want the camel that we left behind over there. 
One thing that I really wish we had gotten, though, was a potato or carrot, because we don't have any of that. We'll need to scavenge some <coughs> visit and trade with some villagers in order to get that, I think. Okay, give me a minute to sort through the inventory. Uh, definitely want to make a bow in the next episode. Need to do that. Fit. It's raining. It's literally raining outside in real life right now as I'm doing this. <laughs> <laughs> okay, cool. Uh, plenty. Actually, we have the exact amount of like horse armor and saddles. When we have three name tags, I can't just name one dog and then leave the other two. I already have the names, obviously. Uh, but I can't just name one and then leave the others without a name. So I'll name them when I have the name tags for all of them. How about that? Also gonna take you. Place that there. I have coal and these, so... I think I'll leave like four pieces of coal in each of them, maybe. One, two, three, four. Ah, let's leave like eight in total. That's probably a good number, right? Eight, one, two, three, four. Nice. And this is all the loot. I'll leave the golden apple here. That's special. Uh, glowing sack is mob drop. And then up here, da -da -da -da, we have plenty of redstone. Plenty of lapis. Don't even know how to store this stuff. Like, look at this. Boom. We have processed iron. We have raw iron, which I need to smelt. We have coal. And then we have... <laughs> we have 66 diamonds. Ladies and gentlemen, in the next episode, we're gonna get an upgrade. I think we might set up enchanting in the next episode. And I'm gonna take a well dessert. That's not where my bed is. We uh, I do need to get rid of this furnace, though. Uh, we're gonna take a well, very well deserved rest. I'm also gonna take this, because this does need smelting. Ladies and gentlemen, I think that's gonna do it for this episode. I'm really happy with the progress. I mean, look at this stuff. It's it's great. I need to smell some stuff probably off camera. Like, I'll dump this in here, and maybe this in here, and then probably this in here, and can't do anything there. But yeah, there you go. Um, in the next episode, we're gonna get some upgrades. We're gonna get diamond stuff, because we have it. Uh, we don't quite have 30 levels, which is annoying. So we can't really do proper enchantments yet, but we can make an enchantment table anyway. We can make an enchantment table. We'll pro- don't you blow up my house. <laughs> that got me scared. Uh, I need to set up animal farms. So we'll probably do some of that in the next episode as well. Some farming, maybe an enchantment table, and maybe we can get some low-level enchantments. Oh, iron armor is actually still fairly decent, so we may save it, save the diamond armor until we can get some 30 level enchantments. That might be something. Let me know your thoughts on that down below in the comments. Should we make diamond armor and have low level enchantments, or should we wait with the diamond armor and just keep using iron with low level enchantments until we can set it up? I also am not going to keep the enchantment table in my house. I kind of feel like I want to transform one of those caves up there to some mystical cave filled with moss and stuff like that. Don't know if that's what we are going to do in the next episode. I have plans. I have ideas. Hope you enjoyed this one. Leave a like if you did. Stay tuned for the next episode where we're going to do something along those lines. And I hope to see you then. Until then, have a wonderful rest of your day and goodbye.